You are suffering from cognitive dissonance. They are just ignorant. <laughs> <laughs> This is the reloaded episode of Walk in Her Shoes for a Mile, as we promised last week. Our Nero informed officers talked walking in high heels around Kampala capital city, helped by civilians who looked beautiful in the high heels. <laughs> oh my god. This man was a shining star. He went the extra mile by carrying bananas. We are imagining not only the shoes. We are imagine getting, I, I can imagine how painful it was for me to walk. So now I imagine carrying nine months pregnancy and then giving birth. So I want to feel how they feel. <laughs> this young man nailed it by getting into the shoes of expectant mothers. What say you, sir? To show those people who are outside there, those husbands, to take care, good care of their women who are pregnant so that they are not mistreated or they are not uh, violenced at home. Because I have walked along two miles with my pregnancy here, I wanted to show those people who are putting on kakondo shoes to show them that even those women who are pregnant, they are like they should be treated very well. So I want uh, I've walked along, and you, you you're seeing I'm treated. I've been calling this pregnancy for. By the end of the walking a mile in her shoes initiative, they were tired, but looked wonderful in the hills. These officers who are trying to fill or fit into the shoes of women. I'm telling the world that as Uganda police, we are saying no to violence against women by putting ourselves into the shoes of women. That is wonderful, officer. You look smart in heels with your lady's bag. Today we were for walk a mile in her shoes. Uh, I tried to walk for about one uh, kilometer. I could not finish. The leg was burning. The leg was hot. I thought if I continued, I was going to fall. I had to pick up a border border and had to rush here. It is okay, officer. Even the way you sat on a border border looked more. I have felt it now. I can never slap my wife. I can never beat my wife because it is not easy to be a wife. I mean, to be a woman. Today I have felt it. You know, we endure a lot, officer. But we appreciate what you have done in standing with us during the 16 days of activism against gender-based violence. Let me run to Makere University to find out whether it is reopening. We have made an impact. We have made an impact. I don't want us to say we allow a situation for the university to open when we have not acquired anything. We have not got the money as yet. I'm not impressed by this one mass. I'm not impressed at all. Professor James Chigongo, is that the piece of wisdom you are giving to your fellow academics? I believe I have some wisdom. Yes, Professor. Please, use your philosophy expertise to help the university and the entire country. Right? I wouldn't want that. Thank you very much. But the most important point, I would have wanted Professor Rendell and... No, please. Leave him alone. We need more of that energy in this meeting. Let us be patriotic. Good. Let us be patriotic. And I am ready to join the psychic committee to whip everybody so that we speak the language of Akuna Muchezo. Let us allow the university to open. We, can, we, are, we cannot open the university. But let us give an environment for the university to open. Putting a situation does not mean you want it open. Why don't you go back and teach? I am hurt. I am hurt. But I still want to show that I, I have value to this university. I have value to this nation. Which value, Professor? 
And in this country, not university, at one time, I was a, a presidential aspirant. <laughs> Who did you contest with? I wanted to replace Mr. Yoweri Museveni, call him General Yoweri Museveni, but I did not move very far. All right, try again, Professor Chigongo. Let's talk to other people. How are you, sir? Mm, is everyone I talk in my. <laughs> Which kind of English is that? Even your type. Some up. <laughs> that is enough, sir. Let us have a commercial break. <laughs> Ni kwa garange sent. Siri kujusa ngananga wendi. Good. We can make a good collab. Ni kwa garange sawa. Ni kwa garanga woli. Siri kule kanze mama baby. Ni kwa garange sent. Ni kwa garango mwana. Siri kujusa ngananga jendi. Have a merry christmas and happy new year. Agnes Nandi too. Point blank. Emi I love you now. We wed them over. So na da wa avali akavisi.